Today we're going to escape an exoteric cube with a custom background. I start by adding a layer of gravel to create a false bottom. The false bottom will give a place for excess water to drain out of the substrate. Next I add a piece of window screen to hold the substrate. Next I add the substrate. It's a mix of eco earth, worm castings, terrarium moss, and crushed up oak leaves. And now I'm adding the plants. I'm using mini pilea along with some liz ivy for the scape. These are the only plants I currently have on hand that will fit in this terrarium. I'm hoping that the ivy will grow on the background some and spread out, along with work for a good ground cover. I eventually want to get some small ferns to put in here too. Next I add some more terrarium moss, along with some oak leaves. Finally I add a couple pieces of driftwood to the scape. The background along with the rock ledges were carved out of styrofoam and then hand painted. I'll eventually make a video showing how to make backgrounds like this. I was inspired by Jurassic Park to do the T-Rex skull for the background. It's one of my favorite movies, so I came up with the idea of making the background look like it was a fossilized T-Rex skull. The background is also a hide. Behind the eye of the skull is hollowed out and actually has a tunnel that leads down to the bottom of it. This enclosure was originally being set up for E.T. or Cuban tree frog that I rescued. Unfortunately, he passed away before I could get this finished. I put escaping this enclosure on hold for a while because of that. I finally decided I wanted to get it set up as a terrarium with some live plants in it. I don't currently have anything I'm going to put in it. I'm going to give the plants time to establish and possibly add some more. And for now it will make a cool terrarium for me to enjoy. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. And let us know in the comment section below what you think about this terrarium setup so far.